Well, it's a 16-year anniversary with the Radical One. Radical Randy, what do you think, Peggy Corral? 16-year anniversary. Good to have you here today with us. Man, this brings back some good old memories, bro. Well, all I can say is look, listen, and get educated. This is what a bike event is all about right here. All the old school brothers, I haven't seen in a long time out here at Peggy's Corral, but they've always kept that old school attitude out here. And if you look today, I mean, we've got the convenience store full, we got the back alley all the way full. Good old biker brothers out here at Peggy's Corral, Palmetto wise. We got 102.5 here, Attorney Fred Hush, especially born to ride here. We have got Diamond Gray Rock in the house. And of course, Deb here, the owner, what a phenomenal woman and the best Bloody Marys you ever drank. And they've got 350 pounds of barbecue, oh, yeah. hog roast, man. They're, they're serving up, they're giving back to the community along with Born to Ride today on 16 year anniversary. Oh yeah, and Budweiser hooking us up here today with tons of door prizes. Man, that's, you know, this is back in the day when we used to have fun in the biking community where all the vendors and sponsors all participated and giving back to the bikers. That's right, and today, 16 years for Born to Ride, man. Brings back some memories, don't it? Brother, I, <laughs> does this bring back some memories? I, I, I'll be honest with you, 16 years ago when me and Ron Galetti met, it was a dream. And then it became a phenomenon of what we are today. And, you know, if, if you go back through the tapes and look at the changes and everything, Ron hasn't changed as much as I have because I've went through a lot throughout the years with the long hair, the short hair, this, that. But you know what? It's just been the creativity of what this has been over the 16 years. And you know what's funny is people we had on our show 16 years ago that disappeared are coming back now. People that used to be in the bar business got out of it. They're coming back now. Um, it's amazing how uh, things can be a, a routine for a while, like being into boats and being into this. But the biking industry, brother, 16 years strong with us. We're proud to be able to represent such a good community and document the biker lifestyle in a proper manner. But you know what, what it's all about people is just going out there and doing the right thing for our brothers and sisters out there. The camaraderie of what, the adventure, the travel. Man, wow. I'm ready for the next 16, what and about you? And that's what's nice is Born to Ride has taken you, the viewer, all over the country and all over the world in 16 years. It's amazing because we've been to Germany, we've been to Italy, we've been to the Smoky Mountains, we have been all over the world, and you've got to view it on Born to Ride over the 16 years we've been in existence. Thanks to a lot of our viewers that travel and send us tapes in. And that is sort of what we try to do, the biking community from a reel, and a reel is from behind the handlebars of what you ride. Yeah, and another thing, Randy, over the 16 years, you've made some amazing accomplishments. Discovery Channel, you've gone and worked at the Broken Saloon in Sturgis, Speed, all over the place. Speed National TV, Geographic. You've been on there with the Tuttles. Oh yeah, and I did the first ever biker build off thanks to Teddy Smith from Rats Whole Show. And you know what's funny is a lot of you people don't realize we're the ones that got those people exposed to TV. Well Randy, I'll tell you, we could talk all day, but I wanted to spend a little time with you, man, because sometimes we don't get enough quality time. It seems nope. like the quality time we get our is TV time together. Right. I, I really appreciate your friendship over the years and everything you've done for our community as well. Thank you. You're a leader, Randy, and a lot of people look up to you, and there's not many guys like you out there. Well, thank I'm proud you. to know you and proud to call you my friend. Well, I'm glad to call you my brother. Thank you. And really uh, we've watched our families grow together. And you, ladies man. and gentlemen, like today, this 137 stages I've stood on this year alone, and you hear my voice, I'm never going to give up on you. And I know there's haters out there and there's lovers out there, but brother, don't hate a brother that's out there busting his butt to make sure you get entertained well, because that's where my heart and soul's at. There's no haters. They just look up and all. Oh, that's all, brother. And, and they appreciate what you do. We all do. Well, and, and we love you guys. And thank you for supporting Born Rack because it's really, it's really about the riders. It is. It's all about y'all. We want you to ride safe and be careful out there. And God love you and Godspeed. We'll be right back with more from Peggy's Corral on the 16 year anniversary of Born to Ride. Hey, don't touch that remote. We'll be right back after these short messages with more from Born to Ride's 16th year anniversary party at Peggy's Corral. Man, when you talk about a party, it's never a party until Lama shows up, right? You got it, baby. Yeah. This is my brother Johnny and the Lama Tampa and the Lama family. Such a great family. Thank you, man. Familia. Yep. All right, but. But I thank you for coming, Johnny, to the party today. You know, it's 16 years for Born to Ride. It's great to be here. We uh, Every time you call, you know you got us over here. We have done 
many things together, uh, Ron and all the team in uh, Born to Ride. And uh, you support us always, and uh, the least that we can do is support you back. Well, man, it's great to have you guys here, but you've got something coming up because you're giving back again. Llama is doing another good thing for our war hero. Yes, sir. So tell us about it, Johnny. When is it coming up? Yeah, this is going to happen December 3rd. Uh, 3rd. Uh, it's the first Saturday in December. We're going to, our honoree this year is Sammy Lugo. It's a young kid that unfortunately got wounded in, uh, in Iraq. He lost a leg and badly damaged the uh, the right leg and uh, he'll be the previous honorees were uh, Romy and some of you guys uh, supported us over there the biker community uh, came out uh, in bundles uh, the first year for Romy then last year we had uh, Joel Tavera and this year we hope to uh, bring it again and, and, and for the whole biker community to come and support us uh, to honor Sammy Lugo. So this is the third year that Lama's doing this but Johnny, why do you do it? Why do you do it? Well, uh, why do they do what they do over there? They put their lives on the line for us so that we can do these type of things. We ride free, and it's because they're over there getting beat up, killed, and I mean, I don't have to say it. Uh, and uh, so this is the, the least that we can do to honor them, to let them know that we respect them, that we thank them for all that they do. So we're calling everybody out to the party. When's the party and where is it? The party is going to be at our clubhouse. Uh, the address is 5019 Denver Street, right off of 41. Uh, and uh, it's going to be from 12 to 5, Saturday, December 3rd. Okay, guys, you know, at a time like this in the year when it's Thanksgiving time and uh, we, we've got to get people out here to support people, especially like this. This is our military heroes who, who give all. What do you guys think about this, man? <laughs> give it up for them. And Johnny, I thank you so much for being here today. You brought everybody out. Um, thanks again, man. Any last words? Elvis, no, just, you know, now let's get a cold beer and have a good time on your 16th uh, anniversary, which is great. Born to Ride is always doing great things for the for us, the biker community. Always present, always giving it 100%. So we're the ones that thank you, Ron. Oh, man, thank you, you and all the team of Born to Ride. Woo! Thank <laughs> you.